Hey there, it's time for dinner. We are having some honey garlic pork chops tonight and I always like to make it up with a good pot of white rice. So I already have the rice going over here. And so I'm gonna scoot y'all back and let you take a look at what we're doing. It's a really easy recipe. I'm gonna go ahead and get my iron skillet going on a medium high, more to the medium side than the high. And I've got some nice, thick, boneless pork chops here. You can do this with bone-in if you want. We just prefer the kind that do not have bones in them. So, I'm patting them dry real good. Well, I salt and peppered these. My dog went crazy because my honey's home. And so, she was just barking so loud I couldn't hear myself think. But I salt and peppered these pork chops on both sides. And I'm going to put about a tablespoon and a half of butter in my skillet over here and I'm gonna put a drizzle of olive oil and I'm gonna let that butter melt and then I'll be right back okay our butter is melted so I am going to add some garlic first Ew. <laughs> Did y'all see it explode on me? I need about three teaspoons. Get that out of there and that's about right. I'm gonna add some water, about a tablespoon and a half. About two tablespoons of soy sauce. I can get it to open. Use about one and two. Then we're going to do some lemon juice. I'm going to do about two tablespoons of lemon juice. And our last item is some honey. I've got a quarter cup of honey here. Stir that around. <laughs> and then I'm going to place these pork chops in here. I'm going to let that cook down for about three minutes and we'll be back. It's been three minutes, so I'm going to flip these babies over. And then I'm going to cover them for about seven minutes. And I will be back in a second. We're going to have some zucchini with this. So I'm going to spray my cookie sheet with some foil, set that aside. Now right, let's check on the pork chops. Whew, that is hot. Let me turn this before I can get to it. Now I'm going to turn these over again. And I'm just going to turn them off because they are done. I'm going to cover them back up and let them just sit there until we're ready. So I'm making some zucchini. I don't think y'all can see. Hang on. There we go. I think you can see now.
I've got my oven going at 400 right now. So, get these in a bowl. I'm going to drizzle them with some olive oil. And then we like this. I'm not even sure what all is in it. It's got some garlic and onion and salt and pepper and all kinds of stuff in here. Just sprinkle it all over there. And then give it a spoon. Stir it all up so everything gets coated real good. And the oven is ready for me to stick these in there. I should have started these first. I just didn't even think about it. What we were going to have to go with it. I hope I'm not the only one that ever does that. I'm going to spread them out on a, a cookie sheet here. And then I'm going to stick them in the oven. Those will go about 12 minutes. We'll be back. The zucchini is done. There we go. I did that for about 15 minutes. You can go as long as you would like on it. And it also depends on how thick you uh, cut your zucchini up. But everything is ready, so I'm going to plate everything up. Let's get some pork chops. I like to turn it one more time before I put it on the plate. Get a spoon of some rice. And then I didn't get anything for the zucchini. some of this good juice Pour over the top of the pork chop and over the rice Got me some sauce to dip it in. Mm -mm -mm. Our bellies are growling. So we're going to go have dinner. Y'all go make me some honey garlic pork chops. Bye.